welcome back to Everything's Funny 3 a.m. My name is Yogg, and as you can see, we're not playing some more shivers because I gotta get it working again. <laughs> so, I kind of wanted to show you one of the main reasons why I'm not doing things lately. Now, before, I was just being a lazy prick. Now, I'm addicted to th this again. World of Warcraft. Good old WoW! Doing this one again. I uh, decided to start off in Tanaris. Uh, near the Caverns of Time, because that's kind of where I stopped off last night. So, I I just, I love this game. I've loved this game for dude, 10 years. I love fiddling around. I love going to the different places. I love, you know, just being part of it. Because it's, it's fun. It's a fun game. Especially if you had the history that you have with this. Um, right now, as you can see, I'm not, I, I got the UI disabled mostly just so I could show you that it's, I don't know, there's a, there's a little bit of a beauty to the, uh, the, the desolate plains of, of Tanaris, of, you know, the sand dunes and the, the ruins out here, but, um, I kind of wanted to show you, and this is something that I haven't seen a whole lot of, is people going through some of the old dungeons and kind of talking about them and just design quality wise. Um, I was not a big fan of Cataclysm when it came out. Um, I actually kind of just f was furious because um, I was I was done pretty much with WoW after Lich King because it took so long to get my Kingslayer uh, title. <laughs> I was just like, nope, not doing this no more. So I, I kind of stopped a little bit, came back, did mop, Still didn't have a whole lot of fun with all the, the rest of the stuff, even though I kept running, you know, some of the other things. But uh, my main drive to play it again was to play... Oh, hello. The hell are you? It is a moose. Hello, Dark Moose. Truly, truly, it is an evil moose. Um, but one of the main reasons why I wanted to keep playing was because I, I liked running through some of the older dungeons, and that's what I'd like to go ahead and do today. This is, as you can see... The Halls of Origination. It's a, a really quick, fast dungeon that you can do if you're level 100. And it's best to do it on heroic mode because it's it's kind of fun that way. Uh, but it's it's super quick, super easy. I'm not going to be running it in. I'm a, I'm a warlock. Uh, I should probably zoom in on here. Uh, hello. Woo. Ah, too close. Uh, undead warlock because, you know, horde. Really the only way to go, actually, at that point. Um, but I just, oh god, see, I like this. Look, look at the design choices here. Look at all the little, the, the crap on the bottom. Like, come on, man. You know, somebody designed all that shit. Like, nobody goes to this anymore. Nobody wants to come here. Because, you know, there's, there's like crappy loot and it's got like a weird Egyptian feel to it. And a lot, a lot of people want to have to deal with it, especially since older, or Oldham? Whatever the fuck, where are we? Oldham? Oldham. Oldham sucks. It really does. It really fucking sucks. Um, I'm also not running this with a, uh, a UI, any kind of UI changes, mostly because it's really close to the point when we're going to have Legion come out, and I could download the Curse Client, which, you know, curse.com, if you guys go there, I'm, I'm plugging it just for myself because I, I like them. They've, they really hooked me up after the last couple of years, um, but uh, I just, I don't feel like wasting all my time going through that shit. <laughs> Again, have to set it up, click, 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 no, no, I'm not doing this. Um, even though they make it really easy on that one, because it does, it sounds like a little client on there. I don't feel like dicking around with it today. I don't, I don't want to deal with this shit. A um, couple of things about the the uh, the character that I'm running, engineer. Um, so I've got daily bobs here where I can, you know, reduce speed, run, all that other kind of stuff. Um, Destro warlock. So I'm got the demonic power, extra, all that other kind of stuff. You don't really need it for these guys. Uh, even if you're running it as heroic, uh, it's level 85. You can still just everybody. But um, I just I kind of want to show the. You, you may not have run this. You you may not have run the halls of origination, 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 something like that. But I mean, because it's it's cool. It's it's really cool. Somebody really worked their ass off on this, and it's beautiful. But it, like, it's awful at the same time. Yeah. Anyway. My haste is shit, by the way, so that's why it takes forever for anything to cast. I'm sure I'm going to get, like, somebody telling me, like, dude, you suck. But, uh, 
it, this has always been kind of one of those fun things to just do. Just go through, play some of the old dungeons. Uh, I'd be showing you one of the, the raids, because I've been running 25-man raids just to get the, uh, the, the gear, the transmog gear. Um, because we're kind of just out of stalemate doing stuff. We're waiting for the new stuff to start. But, um, it's... Hey, this is this is fun. This is cool. Look, they, they got weird, you know, Stargate centaurs running around. Nobody wants to come here anymore. This is so sad. And they got the, the same floor pattern that they've been running this entire time. I mean, I get it. It's just like like a 4x4 four four square that they just click, 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 click. But it's still really fucking cool to me, and I don't know why. Because they, they tried to make it both Egyptian feeling, but also with the kind of older... Um, Norse, you know, Scottish thing that they were doing with some of the, uh, um, the, most of the Titan stuff that they keep running around. So, the, I think they did a great job on this. From a, like, a very pretty, you know, design quality style thing. Um, as for the actual playing of it, it's, yeah, no, fuck this. Woo! Rocket! Ha! <laughs> ha! Bitch! You are not prepared. Again, like I said, this is this is a really quick one to run if you're just running around having some fun. But uh, yeah, let's see more guys, more centaurs. I love these guys. I I just you know I I wanted to see them come in. This is it reminds me of Mass Effect, like the the third one. So you sit there, you work out with the Elcor, and, and you work out with the Volus, and you, you work your ass off to get them. And then in the cutscenes, you don't see that. You know, you just see the same set of guys that you've been seeing. You, they just didn't want to go through the effort of having one of your Elcor guys just freaking the fuck out and shooting everybody. Um, yeah, just, uh, with the, uh, the, you know, heavy armor platforms, basically walking siegeons is what they are. <sighs> now you can... Uh, kind of go wherever the hell you want at this point. If you go up to this guy, it's the, um, it's, it's a really annoying little bit of the, the boss fight. Not anywhere near as cool as the, God, was it, what was the other place? Oldham? I know it was at, like, Oldemar. Oldemar. Um, where you got the Staff of Ra and you put it on the little tiny city and you did the whole bit for it. Still got a lot of that feel to it, mostly just because it's Egyptian and you, you know, you got Bronn here just chilling out. Hey, we just got to know. Open the damn door. Oh, damn. Um, one of the uh, kind of a pro tip thing, even though it's, I'm nowhere even close to being a pro, these guys just keep respawning, and they really can't. At uh, if you're a higher level person. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm talking over Bran. Drugs. Why did it have to be drugs? It's always drugs, buddy. It's always drugs. Yay! So, kill that guy, light starts shooting through, and... Pew! Laser beams! The Vault of Lights. You adventures. I love that. It's like, I don't know. Are there multiple people here or are there not? I can't tell. Again, look look at the look at the floor design. You know, and maybe it's because I did like the the best designed place back when I was I was really full on raiding, other than like Ice Crown. I'm I'm thinking B like vanilla and BC. The best design that we had. I see look at this! This is such a waste. Nobody cared about Cataclysm. Nobody did. Not even Garrosh cared about Cataclysm. And he was the main focus there. <sighs> so sad. And look, the floor bottom starts shifting around. God, this is cool. I really hope that they take some of the design elements from this area and put it in the stuff for, for Legion. Because this is really cool looking. I mean, look at that. <sighs> this is just sad. Woo! Fuck you! And no, I'm not gonna even bother looting anything. There's no fucking point. Um, I've got enough gold. I've got enough everything else. This is strictly, really, for loot. Um, 
but actually at this point it's kind of just for fun and, and whatever rep I get for uh, the Ramerkin. Because I'm trying to be... Yeah, see, I just got revered with them. Because you, I skipped through. I skipped through the entirety of that... <laughs> that, uh, that I, I don't think I actually played Cataclysm when Cataclysm came out. I think I played Cataclysm to level up to get to Mop. That's all I did. for this, Especially for this guy. Poor bastard. And, oh, that's all of them. So look at that. Oh, no! Look at that. Ah! Dramatic reveal! So you can see this. Woo! I like how he's just smiling. Smiling the whole time. What up? Herophet. Oh no, he's gonna hit me up and I win. Yay. <laughs> uh, do I? Okay, I haven't. Okay. We've done it! Control room! Get in there! Yeah, yeah. All right, and port back over to Char to make it a little bit easier. And now we're going to go out this way. So, like I said, this it just design elements and all this other kind of stuff. So pretty, look at her! Have you been here? The, ask yourself, if you play WoW a lot, have you been here? Have you really kind of looked at the ceiling of this area? Somebody worked their ass off on this damn ceiling. Yeah, yeah, Venomous Skitter, whatever. Ugh, I hate that. That, I will say, is the worst part about trying to do shit through here. You just, uh, that and that disorientation. Oh, I'm disoriented. It's because I didn't give a fuck for about ten seconds. Yeah, fuck off. <sighs> Woo! Look, I'm a warlock and I have sprint. Yay! Don't stop me now. I'm having such a good time. See, look at that. And look at this. What the shit is that? I mean, that's a really cool... I mean, this is kind of a bullshit run-up. I think we should have, like, you know, skittering crabs or whatever the fuck we had in uh, AQ for this shit. But look at that. Look at that. That's pretty as fuck. And camels. There are fucking camels. For no reason. For no reason. Although this is a shameless, shameless repeat of the boss from uh, Ice Ground. He's just like, yeah, no, I'm a, I'm also an Earth Ranger. That's why I have multiple skulls. That's kind of how I roll. <sighs> and win. That's what I... Oop. Oop. Soul Releaser. Did I get this before? Oh, I don't know if I've got that. <sighs> Alright, everybody come on up. Round them up. Round them up and death. And there's actually nothing in that room. Ah, you know what? This is the whole thing about design. I gotta show it. I gotta show it. This is cool looking. Right. Look at this. Like, what is this for? We got, we got, we got, like, people just chilling? Gold? Look at that! Look at that! Come on! That's cool! And he's huge! Why is he huge? I don't get it! Is that another one? That, that was the sarcophagus. Look at this. Look at this. Again, look this whole area, so cool, and it had to be part of Cataclysm. It just had to be there. It had to be fucking Cataclysm. <sighs> yeah, Vashir, Vashir sucks. I I finally went through and I checked it all out. But that that one kind of sucks. But like, look, this could have been a whole another boss area. They didn't do anything with it. I don't know. Alright. I like how it doesn't even fucking ask me. It's just like, yeah, just, uh, just port back. Yep. Neither does this one. Oh, does it? Oh, I guess it does. Look at that. Look at this. This is crazy. You got these guys. Each one has a distinctive look. Well, the... Uh, They've got a distinctive color scheme. Let's let's go with that. 
I'm getting a little pissed off that my, my apparently my rocket launcher has more power than any of the rest of my single spells. Hmm. That's a little bit annoying. Ah, whatever. Alright, so let's go ahead and start off with Anubis. Uh, one of the things I do like is, yeah, you've got four uh, like different bosses right here. So it could technically get hectic, but it really won't. Where's my... Oh, hello. Woohoo! And I win! Scepter of power. Right. Do I got... Where's that other one? Here. Soul releaser. Do I got this? Okay. I, I guess I did. I guess I had it. Okay. Interesting. Again, for the most part, just going through this for trend and small gear. But, uh, oh, there's my... I know somebody's looking at me like, what the fuck are you using that for, buddy? It's what I've got. <laughs> like a boss. Alright. So now we're going to go for Ram Guy. I, I don't even, I'm not even going to bother to try that. Now, these guys will also give rep. Um, again, I could be going for rep, but I, I don't care. Look at that. You know, somebody put a vase in that corner, and that was a design choice. Choice. Blah, blah, blah. Somebody specifically decided on that. To me, it, it it could be a bunch of stuff just slapped back together, but it looks like somebody worked hard on this. Ooh, got that one. Yay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, fuck off. One of the things that I've, I've noticed, and maybe you haven't had a hard, hard time with it, but I have, is when I get gear, um, I have to actually put it on, put it off to actually get the, the credit for it in my my uh, transmog thing collection. My collection of transmogs. It looks like ass. I mean, what I'm wearing right now looks kind of like ass, but it's, at least it looks like manly ass. The rest of it, not so much. You know, it's like, bleh. The construct of magic. Isis. <laughs> I was going to make an Isis, like a 70s Isis joke, but I don't think anybody would get it, and I probably wouldn't even really know how to get it either. What do you see? Not even worth it. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to leave your dead ass there. Not even going to play with you. One of the other things that I, I wanted to show was, this is kind of cool. If you ever want to just check out stuff, whether or not you have it, it's got the, do you have this? Yay, I kind of want that because I, I look like a ninja, I think. Let's see, reset. Burp. Then, ninja. I don't have this either. That's kind of a cool looking, you know, that's that's cool looking. Somebody worked off on that, come on. Worked off. <laughs> Somebody worked hard on that is what I'm trying to say. They worked off real hard on it. Yeah, yeah, they did. Um... Let's see, Ugh. so slow. Out of my way. Look at me, I'm Andrew Dixonson. Out of my way. Yay. Oh, these guys didn't take kindly to that. Oh, that's right. Come on. Come on. Come on, I'm Andrew Dixonson. Out of my way. Ugh. Whew. That's another thing I've been noticing. Apparently my spells do random shit now. As a warlock, it worries me when I kill things at random sometimes. But not really, because, you know, warlock. And rocket! Boom! <laughs> I hit him so hard the game glitched! Eh, uh, whatever. Alright, and that was it. That's the Halls of Origination. That took me, like, what, 18 minutes altogether? Probably could have been a lot faster if I had been, you know, sprinting or had a minor speedy boost or something like that. But, eh, no. It's fun. Fun. I could go up to the third story. Ah, eh, probably will. Just to kind of show you what's going on. Just, uh, there's, there's another little weird design choice. I love, I love this, this whole 
thing right here, the uh, the elevator, just because it's it's got that little light shine on it. When you go all the way up to the third floor, and then you go all the way back down. It's got a little bit more light kind because of, it's it was pushing it down, so it's it's got that kind of coming back up. So see the beards, another bearded guy, third beard, fourth third uh, lady, and then Bran, who's like, dude, check it out. Unfettered access to the repository. Yeah, I'm sure that's what you wanted. Sick bastard. Bring the elevator down to the third floor. Oop, wait, no, that's... This is the third floor. First floor, there we go. And it's gonna go... Pew, and it's gonna come right... Look at that. I like that. Little little particle effect. Pew, 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 pew. Because it doesn't know what to do. Because it's like trying to come down, but it's not really... Ah, shiny. Look at that. Yeah, awesome. Alright, and if... You're in the Halls of Rejuvenation. Make sure you're taking these little portal disky things. That's at. Aha! So they don't work. Good. I'm not an idiot. Every time I see it, I think I'm a moron because I keep trying to click on them and they're not taking me anywhere. And I'm like, what the fuck am I doing? Where the fuck am I going? Why can't I just teleport back to the place where I was beforehand? And it's just like, nope, you can't go nowhere. Sorry, sucks to be you, bud question I do have is why do each one of these guys have the same face but the guys at the top had a different set of faces did I not loot him all the way I don't know if I looted him what do you got oh that that stupid fucking trinket all right well I see your insides see look look over here so you got some snakes that's cool oh, look at that what is that what is this what is this whole thing right here what are they why do they put that oh Oh, is that a... Oh, I'm going to have to go down and check it. Oh, I can't... Damn it. Damn you, Pit Vipers. Is there a thing... Is there? Are there things down here that I just never knew about? I'm going to be pissed, because it's... It's one of those things that, that that thing doesn't really tell you. Damn it. Whatever. Feck off, snakes! I can just hit these things. What am I doing? Ha ha! Soul Harvester. Yeah. Yeah, I guess that is about it. <laughs>